Do cherry fries. Get comfy. Any scratches, have it now. Oh, go on then. Come and do you to meet Mr. Sully. Right. Ow, oh, beard! Sorry! Thing to do when you go to sleep. Pop the visor off. Oh, the main thing is when you go to sleep, turn the camera off. <laughs> yeah, we don't want to see you. <laughs> right, you're sealed in. <laughs> Huh? You feel claustrophobic yet? No? No. Not yet. I'll learn how you mention it. At least you're safe for them for one of ours. So come on, when you got a nature bath here now. Haha. Well folks, I ask you to turn your attention to one minute to the bottom bar. There are two gentlemen down there with their bicycle helmets on. Bicycle! They are raising money for charity this evening into tomorrow on the 24 hour stint inside their helmets. <laughs> she is behind the bar, make sure you get yourself over, go and donate everything you possibly can. They're on a soup diet for the next 24 hours. So once again, if I see you in your pockets, donate at the bar to the charity, boys of the best luck, we will see you back here in 24 hours later. Don't come up here! Not the f not the fucking beard. Good eye. No. Got it. Oh man. <laughs> Cheating, man. <laughs> Where's the challenge in that? Fair, Terry, I'm very like that, to be honest. I'm a bit of an ass. 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 I'm a bit of an Hang on, more appropriate. Have you come as a cable tie? Have you? <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> what? I've already been done. I can still see you. Just one coke. <laughs> It's not on at the minute. There we go. There we go. You're looking a little bit red. I'm feeling a bit warm to be fair. I'm going to go in a minute though. <laughs> I'm going, I'm going, I'm going man, I'm going, I'm going home, it's going to be a tough drive, <laughs> see you tomorrow son, good luck sleeping. <laughs> Yes. I've got a wife who wants to see me. Work that one out. <laughs> huh? How are you going? In the car. Either way, it's gonna be funny and going out not on the boat. It's in the police pulling while you wear a helmet in your car, you lunatic. Wow. What's worse tomorrow? I've got to go and pick my trousers up from street bike. In the car. I'm going to look the right way. Oh, no, I, I, I've got help. No. Look. It's like a doubt now. It's just you to cook it up inside. Cook it out. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. See you soon. Have fun. I'll try. <laughs> See you tomorrow. You see you tomorrow. Mind your face on the camera. <laughs> Hello and see you tomorrow, I think. Is she coming tomorrow? You are. In a bit. Huh? See you tomorrow. Yeah. In a bit. In a bit. Mind the camera. There we go. See you later. See you later. Yeah, try and get some sleep. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> so it's begun. It's going to be twenty four hours of me heavy breathing because there's going to be no motorbike to overpower the noise and somehow I'm going to drive home with my helmet on hopefully we won't see any police so I'm sure they'll have some questions god this is going to be interesting
bad actually, got quite a good field of view. As it were. I'm sure if me really invited down, ain't gonna see nothing. So yeah, here we go, 24 hours inside my lid. I've done half an hour so far, and I'm hot and I'm, I'm uncomfortable. And, oh God, this is a crazy idea. But it's also raised money for Birmingham Children's Hospital. So it's all going to a good cause. And I'm just going to have to keep reminding myself that for the next 24 hours because, oh my god, this is going to be hard. Um, stuff that's planned. I need to go to Street Bike, which is my local bike place. Because um, I've got some Lindstrand's uh, textile trousers that I've had for... Um, I've had them for 18 months and one of the seams popped probably a couple of months ago to be fair um, and I thought nothing of it but uh, it turns out that they've got um, a two year guarantee on them so I took them back and they've been assessed and they can't be repaired so I've had a brand new pair sent over from Scandinavia so I need to go and pick them up which I'm not sure whether I'll be going in the car because my boy Finley wants to come or whether I should go on the bike which to be honest seems a more sensible idea or whether Kevlar jeans and go over on the bike with a backpack because I don't know how driving around in a helmet is going to be taken to be honest um, I want to go and get a new number plate for the bike tomorrow don't know whether I will to be honest and um, I've got to help the wife to prepare the house because we're having a Halloween party um, mainly for Finn so we're having a Halloween party from 3 o'clock onwards doing some trick or treating so uh, yeah Oh God. All I can do is apologise for the heavy breathing but the microphone is literally by my mouth so you can hear me. Um, and I haven't got the noise of, of the bike to to get rid of it unfortunately. So it is what it is. It's going to be a bit heavy breathing but there you go. Don't worry, you're not not all the footage is going to be like this. I've got the selfie stick prepped, so you will you will be seeing me. God knows, I don't know, trying to eat or drink or whatever else it is. I decide that I'm going to try. I've got to eat. I just don't know what I'm going to try and eat. And I should have probably had more than a sandwich for tea, to be honest. But it is what it is. Christ, that's bright. So yeah, here we go. On my way home to the wife. Finn will be in bed asleep. Hopefully. God knows what I'm going to do if you daddy on a kiss. Because, um... Oh man, I can't even kiss my own son. Jesus Christ, what a stupid ass idea this was. Uh, nearly home now, so 
For obvious reasons, I'm not going to film right up until the point where I pull up on my drive and walk into my house. So I'll, uh, I'll see you in a moment when I'm in my wonderful abode. I don't know. Thank the Lord, they've killed Joey Essex. Is that real life? <laughs> Yeah. Oh. 